guys, welcome back to another video. It's pretty dark out. So today we have deadlifts today and we're feeling pretty good. I had my third meal today and that just consisted of eggs and cheese and then chocolate milk. My diet's been a little bit different than you guys are probably a little bit used to. And I think I covered it on last week's video, but I'm not 100% sure. But here's the whole thing, right? I'm on now 12 eggs, a whole gallon of milk, some juice, and maybe a protein shake here and there and whatnot. That's about it. Easy calories. It's a little more expensive than I wanted it to, but it's actually doing quite right. Also, Pop-Tarts. So we're basically back on the high school diet. Right here was a huge package from my protein that I just tore into. I didn't feel like videoing just because my camera was in my car and I couldn't find it at that moment and didn't realize it was in my car, so I just, you know, tore open it. But this is what we had in it. We have a nice my protein base layer followed up with some base layer shorts. Ooh, dude, this, this thing's looking nice. Dude, my protein's coming out with some actually crazy stringers. I've been liking them lately. I got a black one, a white one, and now this uh purple one. So we just arrived at the gym. I fucking have so much shit. Two belts, a bag, two cameras. Now, he might be saying, Sawyer, why do you have two belts? It's because I'm bringing Justin the Brandon Harding belt because his belt, he broke in it. I, I showed that in a later video, but yeah, I'm just being a nice guy. I'm giving him a, one of my belts because I honestly don't need two belts. As you guys just saw, 706 moved very, very well. I was super happy with that, you know? Uh, we're slowly getting back into like the 700 ranges, which is very nice for me because if they're moving good, that means max out time will be good, you know? I don't know if we'll be hitting the 800 deadlift before my meet or at my meet because I just don't know how that whole entire thing is gonna work. I'll have to discuss it with my coach because I am planning on doing a meet and like, you know, an 800 deadlift in a meet is also very, very awesome, but it's also like, hey, I'm training on official comp plates and not my comp plates. So, just to get you guys kind of in the loop with what I'm planning on doing is I'm probably going to be moving to Fargo just for a month, just so I can train on proper calibrated plates. Uh, there's one gym out there, uh, it's a private owned gym type thing, uh, just a bunch of people do it. I haven't been there actually, uh, my friend Chase went there, so we're gonna go over there, and I'm gonna see if I can get a pass and if I can deadlift there. If we can, great. Then we have four weeks of steady training on kilo plates. You know, it'd be very, very awesome. Uh, we'll see if that actually happens. That's hopefully the whole entire goal, but you know, things can change. You know, I might, you know, just drop out of meat out of some odd reason, or like the meat got canceled or something, you know? But yeah, uh, 706 went very, very nice.
That was heavy. We finally finished up those nines. Those things, oh, it moves smooth, right? But it's just doing nine reps is very, very uh, killer, if I would say so myself. But those are needed in order for me to, you know, hit that 800 pound deadlift. You know, more volume is something that's very, very mislooked. And people think, hey, let's just do ones, threes, fives, and over I'm here doing nine reps, you know, and we're keeping it heavy. but. It's gonna be all worth it when we get up to that 800 pound deadlift, you know? I'm just, I'm like, <laughs> I'm excited about it for whenever that does happen, you know? I gotta stay on point with my diet and my sleep. The sleep's been a little bit off, like I said, because of the whole surgery thing, but we are getting back on track. Weights are feeling good. We're in a great mood, okay? We got some neutral pull down. No, neutral grip pro down. Ah! We got some neutral grip pull down, so we're gonna do that, go extra heavy today and then do some single arm stuff and probably finish off with a little bit of biceps because we want to get that little pump. I'll probably take some Gorilla Nitric just because, you know, we need to get a little juicy. So, yeah. I've got so much freaking pre-workout in my car. What the heck? I don't know if you guys know, but I always open up packages, usually in my car. So I've just had an abundance of just empty packages in my car that I just have not, you know, thrown away. So we're doing that right now. This is, you know, just a small portion. And we're just gonna start cleaning up a car because a clean car is a good car. Like I have just pre-workout and shoes and then just packages. We got packages and shoes, pre-workout and shoes, more pre-workout, pre-workout in the front. Like I am spilling out pre-workout out my ears. It's, it's crazy. All done. We're at Burger King. I get a uh, bacon king meal. We just ordered some nice BK. Nothing too fancy. Friend Kyle, who works at Burger King, he's like, bro, order the bacon king. It's like a thousand, like 100 calories just for the burger, and then with the meal, it's a thousand seven hundred calories. And I'm like, you know what? I'll make it an easy day for me with food, and I'll have that before I work out. So. We'll have that. I still gotta bring my mom her food because she wanted to get some food. So I was like, okay, I'll get it for you. So yeah, Kyle. I was just talking about you too. I got the bur. I got the, the burger. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I was parking fast. Say you're my brother. <laughs> is it what? They keep calling you my brother. This is my brother, guys. My name's Oliver. <laughs> Thank you, Kyle. Is this everything? Okay. You're the best manager here. Bye, Kyle. This guy. Oh my goodness. That's the guy? That 
Kyle is gonna be the guy we will be going to LA with for the most part, like that's the plan. And um, we're gonna kinda continue with that. So you're hearing it today on this video whenever this is posted. Uh, I'm planning on going to LA, you know, crossing the fingers for the most part. We got everything planned, so yeah, I'm excited. Today, if you guys don't know, we have legs, we have a heavy single, and last week's didn't go the way I wanted to 100% because it, I just felt super fatigued. I had, uh, that was the day I had surgery, so squatting just felt super, super awkward and everything. But you know, we're a week out of uh, from what the surgery was, everything's kind of healing up just fine. So, yeah, uh, we're gonna send this back, eat the food, get on the road, drive to the gym, and uh, have a good workout. Well, we just got to the gym. I am about 75% bloated, you know? But that burger was good, so mwah. Good job, Kyle, with that burger, it was good. Crap! I forgot my knee sleeves at my house. It looks like I'm driving back. Here they are. We got them. All right. Well, we got them, and might as well take pre-workout now. Hey, say goodbye to the subscribers. Hey, have a good, have a good one, y'all. I think the best thing about having small calves is, you know, you can throw on your knees sleeves pretty fast. You know, if I had these like juicy calves, I wouldn't be able to like just slip them on. So, <laughs> check out that fit. We got the DSU hoodie. We got some my protein. Uh whatever you call them, not leggings, some nice stoic knee sleeves, use code something Sawyer or something, and uh, some nice flame socks, stance, let's go. Not feeling too bad with all those warm ups, and that extra 30 minute drive plus the pre-workout kicking in, mm, feeling pretty good. What do you think Jax, you feeling good, you feeling good?
Alright, so we just moved 561. It went really, really well. I'm super happy with how it moved. And everything's been pretty good on squats. I've been playing around with it for like the last week or so. And I'm finally kind of getting in tune with what I should be doing for the most part. So, form and just like proper execution on my lifts and staying tight has been going great. So, we have some back downs now. We're going to get those real nice. Then when we get home, we're going to eat some food. I think we have also a little bit of benching today. I'm not sure though.